have a nice trip. <laughs> Virtual trip. In Niigata. Sorry, let's do that again. One, two, three. Have, have a, a nice, nice virtual, virtual trip, trip in Niigata. Niigata. Thank Hello you for joining everybody. us. <laughs> We're here live. Yes, you can, you can feel the liveness. Hello, everyone. I'm Mika Walker. I work in FM Niigata. I do radio hosting. I've been here for 12 years, 12 years this month, actually. And I'm originally from the UK, London. And I'm Michael Reimer. I'm from uh, the top of Victoria in Australia, from a little town called Redcliffe. Hello, everybody. Hello. <laughs> I've been here for 25 years, which makes me about 29. We'll, we'll leave it at that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, over five episodes, we'll be exploring Niigata, and we're going to, you know, introduce to you all these wonderful things we have to offer in this beautiful prefecture of Niigata. Yay! So please let us know where you're listening from. We've got a few comments already. Yep. Um, Deborah, hello. Hello, Deborah. Marina from Adelaide. Hello. Oh. Nice Adelaide. to see Adelaide. you. Oh, nice place. Yeah. From, Beautiful your, beaches. from your neck of the yeah. woods. Mm. Danny is listening from Ariake, Tokyo. Hello. Tokyo. Oh. Yay. We've got Alexandra from the Central Coast. Central Coast. Baggio from Sydney. Sydney. Yay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Please, please leave some comments. It could be anything from you've been to Japan before, any experiences you've had in Japan, or the fact that you like sushi. <laughs> yeah. Everything is welcome. And you'd, you'd like to get out of the lockdown and come across. Yeah, please come. <laughs> <laughs> yes, so where are we? Where is Niigata? Okay, well, let's have a look at this here, and this will show you. Now, as you can see, we've got Tokyo down here. That's right. And we're right across from Tokyo up here. Oh, Niigata, <laughs> that's it, right there. We yeah. are actually 300 kilometers across the other side from Tokyo. And uh, that's a four-hour trip uh, by car, if you've got a license, or if you just like to jump on the Shinkansen or the bullet train, the Super Express, that'll only take you two hours to get here to Niigata. The, by the way, the bullet, exp the bullet train takes, uh, the top speed is about 250 kilometers per hour. Wow. But not all the way, just, just on the corners. So you can get from um, Niigata to Tokyo by bullet train between like two hours, two and a half hours. It's really quick. Also, fun fact. Yes. Niigata Prefecture is the fifth largest prefecture in Japan. It's about the same size as, as Sydney. Sydney. Your neck of the woods. <laughs> Sydney. I was there a whole one day once. One day once. Christina is watching from Sydney. Hello. 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 Hello, hello, Sydney. hello. hello Sydney. Hello, We're, Sydney. Our, our prefecture is the same size as where you, you live. Yeah, yeah. just as the uh, <laughs> population is about uh, half. Hmm. But we've got so many beautiful um, places, locations. We've got beautiful beaches, beautiful seasides, beautiful mountains, just a lot of, lot of nice nature. Yes. Yes, exactly. Right. And things to do all year round. So, let's look at these comments. Oh, we've got one from Aoki. Hi, how's the weather in Niigata? The weather? Yeah. Let's have a look. At the moment, it is beautiful. It, it is, is beautiful. Yeah, it is summer here in, uh, in Japan, which is the opposite to Australia, because Australia is it's cold oh, yeah. right about now. It's winter. Opposite. Yes. That's oh. right. They're skiing. Well, no, they're not. They're in the lockdown. Can you ski in Australia? Yes, Australia has uh, the, the ski area is bigger than Switzerland. Oh, really? Yes. Well, you know, Niigata is famous for skiing as well. That's right. We have four distinct seasons. Yes. Winter, spring, summer and autumn. <laughs> All you got to do it is cold. It doesn't rhyme with autumn. No, no, no. Yeah, that's, that's true. That's probably why they take fall. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, so there's things to do all seasons. Like in spring, the cherry blossoms are lovely. Oh, uh, yeah. With mm -hmm. a bit of sake. Yep. In summer, the beaches are lovely. Yeah. Autumn. With a bit of sake. Yeah, oh, yeah with <laughs> a bit of sake. Autumn, uh, the autumn the leaves. Autumn leaves in the mountains. The mountains yeah. change colours to a very vibrant, fiery colour. Yeah. And uh, a bit of sake, then. A bit of sake. But not if you're, not if you're driving. You can't. Yeah. And then the it. winter, of course, there's ski, snowy mountains. Yes. And there's some festivals and, like and, in winter. And electric well. blankets. <laughs> with which sake. is really, really good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we've got a, a five-part series for you, and today is the first part. We have uh, four more, and we're going to be following the seasons. We have uh, two, the next two are in October and November, and after that, in the winter, we'll be going January and March. So, uh, during this five-part series, we'll be showing you uh, the best places to go, the best food to eat, and the 
fun things to do all around the Niigata Prefecture. Yay, yay. So please, if you have any questions about anything to do with Niigata, Japan, or just to say hi, please leave a comment. We will be so happy to answer them for you. Leave the comments around here. <laughs> thank you, thank you. So Michael, where yes. are we going today? Well, part one, we're going to one of the largest islands in Japan. And it's, uh, well, where is it? It's about 50 kilometers that way. That way. <laughs> that way. Yeah, it's <laughs> off, the coast of, uh, off the coast of Niigata. Mm -hmm. And it's called Sado Island. Yes. Yeah, Sado Island. So let's, uh, <laughs> let's have a look. Let's have a look. Here it is. Yeah, yeah I found Sado it. Island. I found it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Sado Island. So, okay, so down here is Niigata. And, and you, you go all the way to Sado Island. Island. Yeah, exactly. So, uh, um, yes. Yes, you want this, this one. Yeah, the next one. One. yeah so you can get a, bo a boat and the one after that. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, there you get the boat from Niigata to Ryotsu from the ferry port that we are at right now. Yes. And you could get two types of boats. Oh, no, no, no. Um, types. The first type is a car ferry, so you can bring your car along. Yeah. If you want to drive around, because driving around Sado is great. And that takes about two and a half hours. It's a really luxurious boat. And then there's also the jet foil, which is like a speed ferry, a very fast Boat. Yes, it's a hydrofoil yeah. and uh, it has a Boeing 747 engine or Oh, that's like, a, that's like an airplane, isn't yes, it? Yes, exactly. Mm. That's exactly. why it flies right across the water like that, I, I believe. <laughs> okay, cool, cool, cool. So, we're in the terminal and where are we going first? Oh, look, look. This is where the ferries come in. Nice oh, scenery. Yes. You can see all the way to, yeah, all the way outside. You go down there. They're Sado. <laughs> <laughs> you go down so there. there. Take a left. <laughs> take a left. That is the uh, that is the Niigata Harbour. And later, one of the big car ferries that we saw uh, in the, on the on the picture there will be coming in. And I believe it is the Okesa Maru, which is huge. It's like six stories high. Yeah. So huge. So so so. So let's take a look. Okay. <laughs> yeah, let's have a take a look at this. Well, here we are. This is Niigata Prefecture and on the coast we've got Sado. And here we're in Sado down at the Ogi District. And Ogi District has a very famous something you can get in and ride on and go out, out on the water. I wonder what it is. Let's go and have a look. Suzuki san desu ka? Hi, Michael desu. 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 Today, uh, we're having Ms. Suzuki look after us, and uh, she's going to tell us all about this uh, something we can ride on and have a good time on the water out there. Hi, Michael desu. 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 Hi, these little boats over here and how interesting they are. I, uh, she explains that these tribunet are originally or, or are said to be miso barrels that were cut down with the bottom and used as a kind of boat so that you can go out on the water and uh, find some shellfish and uh, seaweed and things like that. And uh, they've been around since, well, the Meiji, Meiji era? Meiji no shoki desu ne. Ah, yeah, from the start of the Meiji era. Well, it's a very small boat, and I'm 190 centimetres tall, so I'm going to ask uh, Mrs. Suzuki if it's, you know, if it's OK, if I can get in, or is it going to flip over? <laughs> so, we're off. Here we go. OK, so apparently I get in, and I sit, sit down there. Okay. So you've got to get in slowly, or the boat will, you know, Go up and down. So hold here, she says. Hold here. Okay, here we go. Ooh, yeah. One leg in. It's a bit shaky. Okay. Yeah. Sit down. Okay. Hey, we're in. <laughs> wow, it's beautiful. Look at the water. It's so clear. Oh, she tells me there's a lot of fish down there. Oh yeah, we can see lots of fish uh, swimming around. <laughs> 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 so 
Oh, no, no, no. Well, we can't uh, throw the line in from here, but she says that there are fishermen who actually use this boat now, today, uh, in these days, and uh, they can catch abalone and uh, turban shell fish, and of course, uh, uh, types of uh, seaweed, right from the boat with a long stick. Mrs. Zuki says today is a little bit overcast, but uh, on a good day we should be able to see the Niigata Prefecture through that uh, under, under the red bridge over there. And Niigata Prefecture, or the uh, main island of uh, Honshu, is 50 kilometers that way. So on a good day you can see it. In front of us we've got two islands, Yajima and Kojima. All right. The meaning behind Kyojima is praying. At the moment, she, uh, Mr. Suzuki was telling me about uh, a famous person that uh, came out here on a boat and uh, they were worried about whether the boat was going to uh, sink or not. And, uh, and uh, the, uh, the followers of that person often prayed at that island. And that's why it's called Kyojima. Over here is a monument to a woman who is said to have traveled from Sado in a tribune to Niigata to meet her lover. That is a long way. <laughs> Miss Suzuki explains that she has never taken a drive in all the way to the Niigata area, but, uh, which is 50 kilometers. But she said her friend has been in one of these drive and done the 50k trip to Niigata, and it took 18 hours. But uh, looking over here, the island, the bridge, and the lookout over the sea, it's absolutely beautiful and really worth coming for this, this, this ride, of course, and the view. It's amazing. Hey, hey. Hi. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I asked Miss Suzuki if she was, uh, you know, if she liked to have a sing. Well, Miss Suzuki gave me a great time on that tribe, and it was really good. It's great, you know, atmosphere and great sort of landscaping, beautiful. And uh, the tribe, in it, great experience. And lots of fish in the water. The water's so clear, you can see right down to the bottom. Big fish, little fish. Looking at those fish makes me hungry. So I asked Miss Suzuki, if I could get, you know, something to eat, like what I saw. <laughs> and she tells me that there's something called hamayaki. Hamayaki. What's a hamayaki? I don't know. But she says it's delicious. And while we're here in Ogi, we should try it. Okay, let's go. Well, I think this is the place. Ooh, I can smell something beautiful. What's cooking? Let's have a look. And here we are, the hamayaki. Hamayaki is all types of grilled seafood. But now I'm going to try the turban shell hamayaki. Let's have a look. Oh yeah, it's been cooked. It looks lovely. Mm. Wow! <laughs> okay, let's try. Mm. <laughs> well, that turban shell was really good. Had a, had a you know, the flavor of, of course, the sea. And, uh, and at the bottom is a little bit sort of a, a bittery taste, but it really does match the uh, turban shell. It's really good. You should try some more. <laughs> Hello! Yeah, you see that, hey? Huh? Where were you? Where were you? Huh? Have a nice virtual trip in Niigata, the first in this five episode series broadcasting to you live from Sado Kisen ferry terminal. Hello everybody, there's so many people from all over the world. We have some people joining us from the Philippines, Australia, Melbourne. Oh, Australia. Australia, <laughs> Sydney. And we've got some comments as well. We've got um, Danny, he says, these boats are a big attraction on Sado Island. Oh, the Taraibune. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You've got to try the Taraibune. We'll <laughs> yeah, right. Fiona says, it looks very wobbly. Don't move. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You can fall out, actually. But, but the, uh, the water there is very shallow and uh, hmm. at the, the, that place. Very shallow, safe and uh, very clear. You can see all the fish. And you, know, you can see all this, um, the shellfish and everything underneath. Yeah. It's really magical. You can grab one. It's been about over 10 years since I last went on one. 
but you made me want to go on it again. Yeah, you should go. And you were also trying the, what is it, hamayaki? Yeah, hamayaki is all t types of grilled uh, seafood. And, and that, you had that, the uh, sazai. Sazai, yeah, that's the uh, turban shellfish. Turban yeah, I shellfish. tried that one. Hey, it looked really good though. Yeah, it looked you really like good. You enjoyed it. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. You probably wanted to have one, did you? Yeah, I do. Well, bad Where luck, none for, you, none for you. No, not really. I went diving. Got him. Yeah, I went down, 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 down. Oh, then down I don't want one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want, you want one now? <laughs> no, but I do want to eat one. I want to try. All right, well, I've got don't some for you out. right over here. Mmm. Andre. Oh, thank you very oh, much. Oh, hello. Here. Thank you. Yeah, Look at yeah. that. This is what I risk Look life and limb for. Yeah, beautiful, hey? Beautiful. Yeah. Mm. Why don't you try one, Mika? See how you go. Dookie, thank yeah. you. And this is. Well, actually, actually, I didn't get them. This no. is. Yeah, this is Maren Chikarashi. She's from the uh, Sadoki Sen Company, mm -hmm. and she's the one who was nice enough to provide us today. Oh, okay. Uh, or provide you. So you were with, the. Yeah, uh, a little, <laughs> lying. A little, a little Phoebe. A little Phoebe. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, thank you very much. Did you Thank dive you. in? Did you get them? No. <laughs> no, no, you didn't? Oh, right, okay. All right. Well, let's, Please have uh, a seat. Yeah, have a seat. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Yeah, thank you very much. And thank well, you so much for bringing these. Look at them. Yeah. This is an up close. Nice. So, it smells really good. You can smell like the soy sauce. I think it's got soy sauce on them. Has it got soy sauce on them? Sure, you got it, no? Yeah, it's got a bit of soy sauce on there for you. Go for it. Oh. Itadakimasu. Here you go. <laughs> now tell me quickly, what's it like? Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> it's a, you know, you know, when you bite into it, it's a lot like abalone. So mm. I, I'm kind of, you know, should be like five minutes there <laughs> on the on the one mm. turban. How are you going there? Is it is it nice? Mm. Give me give me some signs. Mm. Give me some signs. Mm. <laughs> oh, she's giving us the heart mark there. So. Yeah, these turban shells are absolutely beautiful. Let me see, Marin san, Hi. Do you, do you, are they from the real deep, deep, deep place, are they? No, no. Not so deep? No, no, so How far deep. down? Uh, about five meters. Five <laughs> meters, only five meters, mm. yeah. So you can, <laughs> you can, it, you can you, but you can enjoy this for such a long time, it's really good. Yes. Mm. And it's like salty, you can really taste the ocean. Yes, 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 mm -hmm. it is. Yes, mm. that's where they come from. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's really good. It's got a nice like um, texture to it as well. Yeah. Mm. It's got like soft parts as well. Yes. Mm. The, the 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 tail part is kind mm. of soft, and the top part is kind of a lot like uh, abalone. Have you, mm -hmm. have you ever tried abalone? Yes, I have. Abalone is delicious, and yeah, it, it does never... taste quite like abalone as well. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. So if Definitely you like recommend. abalone. Go to Stato Island, mm -hmm. get some of this turban shell. Oh, or Lisa Japanese says, yeah? um, food is always awesome in Japan. Yes. <laughs> Natalie says, um, who said sushi? Where? But sushi is also really good in Sado as well, right? Yeah. Sushi. Um, yeah, what's delicious in Sado, ah. in the sushi area? Zenbu <laughs> oishi. Oh. Everything. <laughs> oh, what yeah. about in the summer? <laughs> Not yet. Ika, that's squid. Squid. Squid, squid. is good. Squid sashimi. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Squid sashimi. Squid sashimi, sashimi is oh, um, really. Here. I've had squid on a stick. Oh, really? The, yes. the one that you roast? Yeah, right? it's like a Japanese toffee apple. <laughs> and what other fishes can you eat in yeah. Sado? Booty. Booty. Yellow tail. Yellow tail. Maguro more made. Tuna. Tuna? Yes. Oh, yeah. Do you mm. catch him with a fishing line? Yeah. <laughs> you, know? yeah, you don't know right. fish by yourself. You, you go to the professional and they'll have like, there's so many good sushi bars in Sado. Mm. Definitely recommend. Um, yes, so, um, oh, if you look behind us, you can see mm. there What's is a ferry. Coming in the distance. Mm. Is that it's the car way bearing? far out. It looks really <laughs> small, but it's actually massive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's uh, that is the Okesa Maru, which I was uh, I was lucky enough to come back on. And Marin, nangai tate desu ka Okesa Maru? Rokkai tate. It's six stories, do you know? Six stories. That's yeah. hella big. Yeah, that's right. It's uh, it, it can uh, fit a lot of uh, people. Nani ga nore desu ka? Sen na na hyaku ni kurai. Yeah, the passengers, mm. one thousand seven hundred plus can fit. On the mm. car ferry, yeah. So That's you can take lot. you can take your friends. Oh, yeah, all of them. All of yeah. them, and, and there'll still be room for more. Yeah, <laughs> and it has cars as well. You can take your car or your truck. <laughs> on there. How many cars? How many cars? 
だいたい160台ぐらい160 cars can fit on there and it's two floors for the car parking mm-hmm. All right. What have okay, got the so Um, yeah, and it's a really nice, comfortable ride as well. There's a suite room as well、mm. with、um, uh, what is it? You've got beds and stuff. And, oh, yeah. Yeah, the VIP room, right?、Mm-hmm. Right, yeah, well, it's a two and, and a half hour trip or something like yeah, that. Yeah, exactly. So you can travel in style.、Yeah. You can have a sleep. Have a But、snooze. there's also like, really good food as well. They've got sado curry、um, in the sado shape. The rice is in the shape of the sado island. <laughs> oh, yeah, I tried it on the way back. <laughs>、yeah. It was nice and. <laughs> Hottish. Hottish. A、yes. little spice. It's, It's got a little kick to it. You should try it. It's really, try really it. good.、Um, Comments. Wow. What, what, what,、uh, let's check the mail. Let's check the mail. Check the mail. <laughs> Go out and check the letterbox, will you?、Um, Jill says, tell Michael he's my hero. <laughs> oh, you're her hero. <laughs> well, well, yeah, I'm, I'm a hero, and that's because、uh, that's my twin sister. Stag on the Jill. Jill! Jill, baby! Jen's asking, where's our sake? That was our、really、sake. It's waiting for us after we've finished. <laughs> yeah. We've、well, got a lot of sake to drink. Sake is、yeah. also really good in Sado. Kintsuru is one of my favorites.、Mm. Oh, also, Obakashi Zo is really good. You, and also, the famous one is Hoksetsu. Oh, yeah. Hoksetsu. Robert Hoksetsu. De Niro.、Oh, yeah. one, of my, one of my students makes it. Hey, do you drink sake? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What's your favorite? Do you have a favorite? Or, or do you like all? Zenbu ですか Oh, oh. Oh! Do you drink it hot or cold? Uh, cold. Cold! Oh, yeah, you can drink it either hot or cold.、Mm. But yeah, it's, it's hot right now.、So、yeah, the first、nice、one's like this. The first one's like this. Oh, and after that, you go, oh. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got a comment from Natalie. Natalie? It's like, play Taiko. Taiko? Yes. Taiko. Oh, that's the drum. Yes,、yeah, the drum. A cool no drum.、Mm-hmm. That's,、uh, you gotta bang, bada bang, 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 bada、yeah. bang, 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 bada bang, bang. So. <laughs> so, so, yes, well, talking about the great sounds that come from. Sado Island, yes, we're just talking about the taiko drum, so let's just have a look. Well, I've made it all the way back here to Oggy Town, where I believe they have the Sado Island Taiko Center. And、uh, I want to experience a Japanese taiko. So let's go in and have a look. Oh, hello! Hello! <laughs> Konnichiwa! Is this、Hi. the、uh, Taiko Center? Yes! Can I, can I try the, the, the drums? Yes! The of Taiko、course. drums? Yes. Really? Yeah! Okay, let's go! <laughs> That's right, yeah! Oh, thank you! Hi, do you go? Thank you! Thank you! <laughs> wow! <laughs> look, at, look at all the drums! Wow, there's a lot of drums there! Whoa, that's a big one! Sami chan! Yes! That's a big drum! Can I try、oh, that one? Let's try. Really? Yeah. Okay. Taller than you. Oh, yeah, yeah, it is. Look, I'm 190. Oh, yes. Look at this. Wow.、Oh. That is so big. <laughs> big drumsticks. <laughs> All right, let me go. Let me try. Let me try. Oh. <laughs> That's a big sound. Yeah, good. Good, good. Oh, thank you very much. Hey, can you play? Yeah, can you? Yes. Show me, show me. Show me the professional way. Okay. <laughs> excellent! Thank you! Super nice to see you! Excellent! Excellent! Hey, Trey! Me! So, this drum is really good for you, you know, like、uh, you get goosebumps when you do it. I think it's just the, just the thrill of,、uh, of uh, you know, the, the atmosphere, the big drums and the, and the pounding and, the, you know, the natural beat of the drum. So, Sami chan was saying that、uh, the Kodo drum troupe. 
you know, they're, they're giving uh, performances uh, everywhere and people are very excited about it and they wanted a place where people could come and uh, experience, you know, the drums. Not only watch the, the magnificent Cordo drum troupe, you know, in action, you know, internationally and nationally, but also to come to this centre and to be able to, you know, experience the little drums and the big drums firsthand to get that thrill into you. So uh, Oni Daiko is uh, uh, a performance with the drums uh, that was uh, done in many places around Sado Island uh, at uh, smaller festivals. But the idea was that uh, the Oni Daiko is to good luck for a good harvest and uh, well, good luck for everybody on the island. Well, I'm sure that everybody who steps into this room wants to play the big drum, but uh, I don't think that's the first one that you start with. Okay, so apparently we play firstly on these drums over here and, and, and Sami-chan's gonna let me have a, a bit of a go. Well, Sami-chan sensei is going to teach me how to play the taiko drum, so my job is to try and follow the sensei. Okay, let's go. Hey, spread your legs. Spread your legs? Yes. Okay. And Fun. That is exciting. <laughs> Quite difficult, as you see. I, you know, couldn't keep up to the sensei, but I think it takes a long time. I wonder how long it takes to, to be a good drummer. Do you yeah, can't so go. Go, go. Five minutes, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're a good student, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Hey everybody, have a nice virtual trip in Niigata, the first in this five episode series. We're talking about the magical island of Sado and we're here at the Sado Kisen Ferry Terminal. And the view is amazing, the boats are coming in, the ferries are coming in. Wow, yeah. it's really close now. Yeah, I don't think you can quite see it anymore. <laughs> um, but yeah, you went and did some drumming. We've got some comments as well. Yes, that's a Kodo uh, Taiku drum mm -hmm. experience. And uh, I was, I was uh, well, basically marvellous, I guess is the word. <laughs> you, yeah, you were marvellous. Yes. Um, Maxine saying, now we're talking drums. Yeah, so that's up your alley. You should definitely give that a try. <laughs> <laughs> um, Miyoko says, my yes. friend does the planning for Japan. Hope we'll all be back soon yeah oh the planning what's that the for planning. all the tourism it probably okay oh good yes. <laughs> probably well, michelle uh, says she wants to visit sado on her next trip to niigata please yeah, please come well, yeah you know you, you're gonna have to come to tokyo so we're only two hours away mm -hmm. jump on the not jump on the train then on the car ferry straight to sado island you'll be well, we do have an airport you know. as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so you can quick... cut, fly straight into Japan as well. <laughs> um, Maxine says, oh my gosh, drums are definitely on my list for visiting Sado. Yeah, and such a huge drum. That massive one. That, how, what was that like to... Oh, that was just giving goosebumps. Yeah, really? yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah that, was, that was amazing. Yeah, it's that, different from what we yeah, see on the yeah. VTR. The, the sound wasn't, uh, you know, well, there it's like 10 times louder and uh, the whole thing vibrates right through you. Oh. But the big drumsticks, you know, they, they weren't chicken. So. Uh, ha are they heavy? Yeah. Do you think I could do it? You could do it, yes, could I? yes. You With got the my, muscles. Little, my little arms. <laughs> <laughs> Tyrannosaurus Rex. <laughs> my little arms. Um, Corinne says, how to make reservations. So reservations. For the Taiko. So oh, how, how would you go about yeah, that? Yeah, um, to contact them. Yeah, yeah, contact. I think the best way to get any information and make reservations for anywhere in Sado is to go to the Sado Tourism Association homepage where they have all the information and things to help you out. So yeah, that's the Sado Tourism Association. Please check it out. Yeah, that's a must on your trip. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, Marion, do you yeah. like Taiko? Yeah. Yes. Yes, <laughs> have you seen Taiko before? Yes. Really? Yeah. How, how was it thought of, 
かっこよかった。And Kodo is the group name, right? かっこいい。They're they're famous worldwide. Yeah. Yeah. International. Yeah. And they played at Fuji Rock. They played abroad, and they're a massive, a really good group. Yeah. They look really good. Excellent. Sort of like what you wear. Yeah. This is called a happy jacket. Happy, happy. Yeah. When you when you wear it, you're you're happy. Happy. Look, look, look. See, see, Marin's happy. Happy. Marin's on a decay taiko. Tatai to kotaru. Have you tried the big drum? No. No. Oh well. On your next trip. On your next trip. Next time, definitely. Yeah. Excellent. Well, there's all sorts of different cultures and things to do. So we've got taiko. What else? Well, you know, Sando Island is absolutely wonderful, full of culture and, and, and as we've seen, things to eat. But you have to remember the golden rule, and that is the person with the gold rules. All right. So, uh, Sando is famous for the gold mine oh, and silver as well. So let's just have a quick look at here. This is a is a picture of yes the uh, gold mine in Sado, and uh, gold has been mined in this mine for 400 years. It started off in 1601. I guess somebody tripped across a big lump of gold and said, "Hey, boss! <laughs> hey, boss! <laughs> hey, boss! <laughs> we should dig here. <laughs> yeah, come here. We should dig here." Uh, during the 400 years of mining, mm -hmm. uh, they've mined 78. Tons, tons of gold. Jesus. Two thousand three hundred thirty tons. Wow. Of silver. Wow. And uh, it's open to the public, um, but underneath there are four hundred kilometers of mines. They over four hundred years they mined four hundred kilometers. So. so a kilo a year. But that's all yeah. done by hand, right? By hand. Jesus, that's a lot of mining. <laughs> well, talking about the Sado gold and silver mine, it's now actually seeking inscription into as Wait. a UNESCO world sorry UNESCO World Heritage Site. Isn't that right, Marion? For this. <laughs> well, when, when, when is that? When is it all decided? The UNESCO. When is it? 国内推薦は今年の8月に決まります。Oh, August. This year. Right, this year. This year. すごい楽しみにしてます。Alright, so we're hoping for a good result. <laughs> yeah, it's exciting, isn't it?、Mm. Yeah. Well,、uh, I went to the、uh, still remaining、mm -hmm. gold mine, and it's open to the public. You can go in there. So let's just take a look at inside the gold mine. Well, we've arrived. We're in Sado Island, in Kinzan. It's a gold mine, and if we look at the map of Sado Island off the coast of Niigata, we are here. And if you look over there, that's Kinzan. Now you see, there's a great big V missing in the middle. That's where they mined all the gold, silver, and even copper for a period of 400 years by hand. Not an easy job. This huge mine is missing that big V in the middle. Looks like Godzilla took a bite, but no, that's where they mined all the gold and the silver. And underneath is 400 kilometers of tunnels, like an ant's nest. Next, we're going to go there. Well, I've arrived. Sado Kinzan. That's the big gold mine that we were looking at before. Now let's go in. I've got my ticket, a gold ticket, and see if we can find if people are actually in there working. Thank you. Well, here we are. In the tunnels, and it's a cool 10 degrees Celsius, which is lovely now in the summertime. But in the winter time, it's the opposite. It's actually a little warm. So let's go and see what's down this tunnel. Oh wow, we're really in the mines now. Wow, look at these animatronic miners. They look real. What are they doing? I see. He's、uh, he's pumping water up. It's pumping water out of the mine. This water comes from、uh, you know, springs underneath the earth.、Uh, they obviously needed to get rid of the water. Bit of a tough job, I think. Wow, these、uh, mines are really well done. I hear that there is 400 kilometers of them. 
that would be a tough job to dig. But it's lovely and cool and great for a wine cellar. This is a place for the miners to take a rest. Four hours on, four hours off. Now, let's just lend an ear and see what they're saying. Well, he says he can't wait to get out, see the girl of his heart, and have a drink of sake. These miners had special skills and were paid more than other miners. And you can tell that they have the fashionable hairstyles of the day because they got the money. The mine has a lot of miners. And of course, this was a very important mine, the biggest one in Japan. And the gold and silver that came out of this mine uh, paid for everything 400 years ago during the Edo period and supported the Tokugawa shogunate, the shogun. Yes, very important form of income. I'm not sure, but I think I found my Uncle Alan. Here they are celebrating the discovery of a vein of uh, gold and silver and uh, also praying that the ore would become softer so that the mining would become much easier. And uh, they do have original masks, don't they? Well, it's a bit warmer out here. Uh, actually, it's quite nice. Well, the gold mine was really great fun and uh, I'm ready to go through it again. But there is one other place that I want to show you. Let's go. Oh, look, look, quick, 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 over this way, over this way. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Look at this, this is pure gold bar and it weighs 12.5 kilograms. And depending on the day, that's close to a million dollars American. This gold bar is pure, real gold. And if you can get it out of here, you can't keep the gold, but you get a good gift. So let's try. We have 30 seconds. Oh, it's heavy. 12 and a half kilos. It's, it's playing havoc on the wrist. Somebody pull my hand. <laughs> He's got it. Get the... <sighs> We're out of time. That looked tough. Have a nice virtual trip in Niigata, the first in this five episode series. We're talking about the magical island of Sado. Yes, the golden island. Yay! And we're here at the ferry port, the Sado Kisen ferry terminal. Yeah. On the fifth floor. On the fifth floor. Looking out over the Niigata Harbour. Yeah, yeah, and it's like it's starting to sunset, it looks like. Yes, mm. that's right. It's, uh, we're an hour behind Australia. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, it's only an hour difference. Yeah, it's oh, only an hour true. difference. We're straight um, up, straight down. There's quite a few people who want shout outs. We've got Katie Austin, Hannah from Australia. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. <laughs> um, Sharon, looks like a lot of fun. Alexandra, love it. So much fun. Yeah. Um, it's a good place to go. Nilanda says yeah. it. You weren't bad on the taiko drums. Yeah, I was, I, was, uh, I was pretty good. And she misses Japan so could much. Be, Please uh, come back. Could be my next job, I'm not sure. Yeah. Pro. Yeah, You're a pro. A pro with the drum. She said it only takes five minutes. Five minutes. <laughs> For you. <laughs> yeah, I was a fast learner. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, she was very, very helpful, very, very fun. Great fun. You've got to go there. She's really fun, Sammy. <laughs> yeah, she's really good. Sammy Chan. Yeah, Sammy Chan. Yeah, she was amazing. Good. Yeah. Um, who else? We've got Jill. Um, would you like a job? Um, <laughs> Naomi, um, I'm originally from Niigata, but I've never been to Sado. Why? You should go, definitely, especially well, if you're around yeah, here. It's a bit like that, isn't it? Like Australia, I've never been to Queensland or you know, mm. Perth. But, hi, hi, Perth. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so you were trying to pick up a piece of gold? It wasn't going very well. Well, it was 12 and a half kilos, and I'll tell you what, my bag was pretty heavy on the way home. <laughs> But how many people have been have taken that far out? Well, 
I'd like to say nobody's ever done it, but apparently that must have was like six. In one month. Uh, yeah, I, I heard they were all <laughs> kindergarten kids. Oh no! I mean, that, that might mean you I have a chance. You can't get it out. Because we have different, you know, our hands are doing yes. different sizes. You've got big hands, I've got small it's hands. It's pure gold and it's about a million bucks. Ah, mm. I want to touch it. Yes. Um, but you could, it, there's another way to touch it. You can eat it, right? Yeah, but it's hard to get your teeth in. Yeah. Through that them. little hole. There's ice cream with <laughs> gold all over it. Yes, I heard that. And there's one. Look, look at that lucky person. Who eating is that, that ice cream. It's got gold on it. There are actual flakes of gold on that ice cream. Oh, it does. Oh, it's that handsome guy good. again. It was you all along. <laughs> uh, Marin, have you ever yes, eaten this me. ice cream? No. Marin, you never tried it? Me too. Oh, really? It's lovely. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. The director gave me one for free. Oh, nice. Yes, they normally, yeah. <laughs> uh, the, the taste, you want, probably want to know what gold tastes like. Yeah, I do. It tastes exactly like the ice cream. Oh. Yeah, yeah, it, it's, it's flavourless, but uh, it's, it's still, it's about here, right? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's here. Oh. I, yeah, I got the gold, I got the gold. You've got the gold in your tummy. Yeah, that's right. Oh, that looks so good. Um, but yeah, so uh, we've got some, let's look at the comments. Yeah, what do we have got? That looks really good. Um, enjoying the tour, I have always wanted to visit Sado Shima because it's remote and in the Nihonkai, which is the Sea of Japan. That's from Anne. Anne, hello. Yes. Hello, hello. Oh, there she is. There she is. Hello. Hello. Oh, we can see you. Yeah, through your camera. Yeah, um, yeah. Oh, over there. there she is. There she is. Oh, yeah, I see her. Oh, yeah. we've got, we've got <laughs> Megu. Megu. Hey, she Megu. says that looks yummy. It was yummy, mm -hmm. yummy, yummy. Natalie is, oh, that greenery and the ice cream too. Happy face. Yeah, it was very, very cool. It's, it's lovely. You come out of 10 degrees, mm -hmm. right? 10 degrees in, in the, in, inside there. I recommend a great place to live in summer. <laughs> <laughs> you come straight out of there, you grab your ice cream with mm. the gold on top and mm. you lick away. It's beautiful. Oh, I'm jealous. Yes. Okay, do I, is there, is there one that's going to come out? No? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there was, but uh, it I, I, I was hungry. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> so we've got other beautiful attractions in Sado. Yes. Yes. That's right. One of which mm -hmm. is the Sado No. Oh, the Sado oh, No. The, look, we've got it up right now. The No is a traditional Japanese entertainment where they wear masks and act mm. out a story. It's like a class classical dance drama, a play if you say. And it's been performed since the 14th century. Well, they've been pretty old actors. <laughs> I'm not sure if they're the same ones. But they've got masks on, so you won't know. Right. And this is outside, is it? Yes. yes. That's right. The Sadono is outdoors in right. a rustic setting. It's surrounded by nature and they've got these campfires, these open fires. Oh, really? I, I heard there's like 30 places like this, but in the day there used to be 300. Oh, so, back in the day. Yes. In well, the 14th century. Yes, that's right. It was when there was a lot of gold and everybody could do whatever they wanted. You remember that back then? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I remember. I remember. Oh, good times. <laughs> okay. Now, um, next, where are we going? Let's, let's just have a look at this map again. And I want to take you down to ooh, over here, right the down to tail. the southern part of uh, Sado Island, to a town called Shukunegi, which is, you know, in the southern region there. Mm -hmm. And it's a port town. And it was a port of call for merchant ships. Uh, when was this? This was like between 200 years ago and 100 years ago. Mm -hmm. And uh, the townscape, actually, there it is. Here we are. Oh, We're looking beautiful. at it. This is Sukinegi. The townscape from like uh, over 100 years ago, still in pristine shape. Have a look at this. Now, the interesting thing about this town is that, uh, that it's all made by ship carpenters. Okay. Yes, well, uh, and uh, if you look at these buildings, mm -hmm. you can sometimes see part of them look a little bit like ships. Oh, like these little round, window things? Yeah, they're round like portholes. Oh, that's what they're called. Yeah, <laughs> I imagine that's what they're called. Oh, and this, then, look, yes, here's the famous like the front one. of the ship. Yes, this is the front of the ship. The little sign says salt, so you can, you know, you can get there. Oh, so there's little shops and stuff yeah, intermingled uh, with yeah. it. Are there, are there houses, like residents? Yes, see? there's people, people staying there. Actually, there was a little old lady in there and she was very mm. nice. Oh. Yeah. I walked past, she said, she said, hello, Michael. <laughs> she knew your name. Uh, You're famous. Yeah. Oh, I thought she, I thought she might know me. <laughs> oh, I want to introduce to you guys the Blue Lagoon. Blue Lagoon? Yep, the Blue Lagoon is Would that be beautiful. anything like this? Something like that. Look at it. On a really nice yes. blue sky day. It shines blue. You can go by canoe. 
You've yeah. got little kayak thing. It, it's, the, it's the Dragon Palace Cave, I heard. Mm -hmm. And it's like 50 metres wide. And couples go there because if you look down, if you're lucky, you can see like a heart shape in the wood. Oh, really? Yeah, if you're in love. If you're in love, you can see it. <laughs> Only I saw love. it. Only for the lovers. <laughs> Mary, when, when is a good time to go to the yeah. なつがおすすめです。夏。夏。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サマー。サ
they have lots of good things in them. Yes, so please stay tuned and watch out for us. We'll be coming back in October. Yeah, we look forward to seeing your smiling faces then. Yes, thank you so much. Oh, Alexandra Day, I really enjoyed it. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you, you to everybody who commented. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes. We'll be back soon. Um, and Marion, thank you so much for joining yeah, us today. Thank you for enjoying thank us today. You. Yeah, so ne next time, bring beef. <laughs> yeah, I look forward to steak. <laughs> so thank you everybody, thank you for watching. Yeah, it's really nice of you to I was to Mika. Join us. Yeah. And I'm Michael Brimer and this is Mary. Yay. Yay. Thank, thank, you. thank you very much. Bye. Thank you. See you all next time. Have a nice dinner. Have a nice trip.